Hello YouTube and welcome to another Proxmox tutorial. So in this video I'm going to show you how to upgrade your Proxmox host to the latest version which is 8.1. So are you ready? Let's get started. So as you may know Proxmox has released a new version on November 23rd. Okay, This version is version 8.1 and it has many new features okay so the major new features include software defined networking secure boot new bulk action upgrade linux kernel okay and some flexible notification system okay and it has also upgraded the safe reef version okay so first of all let me take a look at the proximo that i'm running now so as you can see here i'm running version 8.0.3 okay and the linux kernel version is 6.2.16-3 okay so we'll try to upgrade this proxmox host to the latest version okay so let's begin so if you are running proxmox in home lab and aren't running enterprise subscri subscription which is uh, how most home lab enthusiasts will be running you need to configure your update repositories okay so this is the first step that you actually have to do so in order to do that we go to our shell okay and let's uh, actually open the file with any editor nano or vi located in slash atc slash apt slash sources dot list dot d and you will find here a file called pve enterprise dot list actually okay so we have to open this file here and we have to add actually a line so this line that will be adding here so so let's open it using actually nano it's more convenient here so i'll use nano so we have actually this is just a, a line that has been actually written by default but here we have to add another line in order to download the update from okay so the line that I'll be adding is this one. So this is the repo. So actually here I have to add deep. Here we go. So this is the line that will be actually adding. So here you'll notice the PVE no subscription. Because we are running an enterprise, we don't have actually an enterprise subscription, okay? So after that, let me save the file. So control X, here we go. So the file is written. So this is our uh, PVE enterprise.list file that has been updated with this line. Okay now. So now in order to upgrade our system, we are here using the GUI. We have to go to our host Proxmox and here you can see a section called updates. So I'll click on it and all I have to do is to click on this refresh button. So another uh, window would appear. and you will see the task viewer display the status of the up get update okay so now the task is okay we can proceed to the next step so the next step is actually to click on this button here upgrade so let's click on it and here another window will appear and here i have a message after this operation, 1,253 megabytes of additional disk space will be used. So here we have to confirm yes or no. So I will just hit enter because you can see here the Y is in capital, 
which means this is the default answer so I will hit yes so the upgrade process has begun and after all the upgrade process is complete we will see what we get so we will wait for the process to complete So after the process has finished, you can see here a message, seems you installed a kernel update, please consider rebooting this node to activate the new kernel. So actually here we have to reboot our machine, but before that let me take a look once again at the kernel version. So as you can see here, the version is 6.2.16, so let's now proceed with the reboot and see what we what we get as new kernel so you can see here i lost connection with our server or proxbox so let's wait for the reboot so this is our uh, new proxmox that has been rebooted so let's take a look at the new kernel version and indeed you can see now the version is 6.5.11 and before it was 6.2.16 so we are actually succeeded into getting the new kernel version and if I go for example to see if the new feature like uh, software defined networking has been added so I will go here to the data center and indeed you can see here that I have this SDN which is software defined network that has been added to the new Proxmox version so we'll deep or go deep dive into these features in our upcoming videos okay and of course here you can see the version number of our environment 8.1.3 so we have succeeded into actually upgrading our Proxmox host from 8.0.3 to the latest version which is 8.1.3 as always I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing bye bye